there are literally thousands of gardening books on the market, but which ones do we choose that are right for us? Well, it all depends on what you really like to do. I mean, there are books that are specific to specific plants. African violets, peonies, hostas, whatever. Trees and shrubs. The only problem with this type of book is there are a lot of trees and shrubs that don't grow in our region. So we try to find books that maybe are closer to our area, but even this little one for Washington and Oregon, again, trees and shrubs that may not grow in this region. The best one is one put out by our own WSU Master Gardeners. This particular one is Landscape Plants for the Inland Northwest. Now there are some books that I say everyone should have in their library. The Organic Gardening Book put out by Rodale, this is a, a must. Especially today when many of us are looking at growing things organically. Great book. The Western Sunset Garden Book I say is always a must for any garden library. Even though there are a lot of plants in there that won't grow in our region, still it is the one of the best. When it comes to pruning, oh, this is a pet peeve of mine. Know your pruning cuts. Know the vocabulary of pruning. Know the tools you need. The best one on the market is put out by our own Washington expert, Cass Turnbull, and it is great. Guide to pruning, the very best one you can buy. There's also one that the WSU Master Gardeners put out. It's called Pruning the Landscape Trees tells you all the line drawings and, and shows you all those line drawings and all the things you need to know there. And of course, this is one of my favorites. It's a new book that's out. Every northern gardener should have this particular one. And it's saving over geraniums and bulbs. Oh, it's great. And house plants, the best on the market. The Reader's Digest, Success with House Plants. I'm Phyllis Stevens. Oh, lots of books to choose from.